Hello, Aries. This is Taria from Hidden Truth Tarot. All right. So, Aries, Sun, Moon, and Rising. Okay. Since I didn't get your weekly general reading for this week out and at a decent time, this is going to be your seven day forecast. Okay. From the time that you see this watch this uh video and hear the messages that's when your seven day forecast starts okay for this reading so i'm not putting a time uh or a date on this okay now aries please keep in mind that this is an intuitive reading remember to always take what resonates and leave what doesn't for someone else okay now i am using the tarot of dreams for your tarot reading and I'm going to be pulling several of these oracles at the end of your reading. I do not remember the name of these, you guys. You can screenshot that and Google it. And I'm sure you can uh, find the uh, name of that oracle deck if that's something that you are interested in. If you would like a personal reading with me, all the information you need is in the description box below the video. All right. So you had some flyers already. There you are, Aries. I love it. <laughs> this is your situation. You're showing up, showing up and showing out right here. Love it. Now, in your foundation, you've got the hermit, the energy of Virgo right there. And then look at this. What's benefiting you the next seven days? is the nine of coins and that's virgo energy as well some of you may uh, have virgo in your charts or it, this could represent virgo season because we are in virgo season and that's just more confirmation that you're having some type of growth um, in your finances okay all right so in your crowning position oh my goodness what you know what you're thinking about look at that cup runneth over love it your cup being refilled now your outcome energy is the three of swords don't freak out this is divine timing right here and i will pull another one to clarify it just to put you at ease because i i, I already know uh this is that's what this is yes king of swords clarifying that three of swords beautiful for some of you this is a court case a legal situation that you're waiting to end this could be a divorce that you're waiting uh you maybe you've been going to court over it for years and now there are finally agreements and compromises being made in your favor okay this can also represent a trust fund and inheritance maybe from a father or a grandfather And I feel like within the next three weeks is when all this abundance is going to flow in. Okay. Thank you, Spirit. So, from the bottom of the deck, the overall energy is the world. Look at that. Beautiful. Now, this is amazing energy right here. Especially, you guys, sorry about that. My dog, Bosco, he has a trachea problem. Um, I just gave him a pill, but he's coughing a lot so if you hear that just know that he's fine he's not choking on anything he's just it's his medicine as y'all know i've had uh, a lot of health issues with him now the world here being the overall energy this is the end of a season a cycle that you have been in this is you know this is the time to celebrate this is an achievement and i mean you need to celebrate i don't care if you think that you had the worst season in the world at this uh cycle that you've been in there's nothing you want to celebrate well i'm going to tell you something celebrate because it's over that's an achievement and that is you showing gratitude that's you know you expressing to the universe to your angels to your guides thank you thank you and it leaves you wide open to be blessed with even more abundance okay and more blessings now when one door closes another door opens aries so you have opportunity here you have a new path uh something new is coming in 
And I feel like for many of you with the Emperor, I know it's your energy, Aries, being in the position of your situation. This is definitely you feeling like you're at a time in your life where maybe you want to uh, start a new position where you're in a leadership role, a position of authority. This could be you wanting to start a business, okay? Um, some of you are thinking about buying a home or selling a home. This is you taking back your power, being assertive, knowing what you want, having that drive, laying a solid foundation that will be unshakable, okay? And it represents stability and security at its finest. You know, this is an energy of you're not worrying about your bills or how you're going to make ends meet. You are comfortable, okay? Now you have the Hermit, the energy of Virgo. This is in your foundation. This is what's driving you. Okay, so some of you are on the road to awakening, spiritual enlightenment. Um, I feel like at this time you're leveling up here. Maybe you have chose to change careers due to you want to do something that's going to be more fulfilling. Something that you have passion for. Okay, it could be spiritually based as well. Now, you know, you definitely are going within when you have questions that you need answers to you are not looking outside of yourself you're looking within and you are definitely connected you are receiving the answers that you need this is also you know that energy of meditation and just clearing your mind and being still and connecting with spirit and your higher self has allowed for you to figure out which path you want to take it's also allowed for you to have a patience with yourself and your journey okay now you have the nine of coins right here this is what's benefiting you the next seven days material harvest independent self-reliant right here you know she doesn't want for anything more than enough money here more than enough material things okay if you're not feeling this you soon will be there's a harvest you're fixing to reap a harvest okay and it's a blessing and it's a material one. Now, for some of you, make sure that, you know, you have work and play balanced. And I feel like since this is what's benefiting you in this position, some of you are literally taking time off from work. You are, you know, going on vacation. You're refilling your cup. And that's wonderful. And you're getting paid for it, too, as well. It's it's a big, nice, paid vacation for you. And you deserve it. You've worked hard for it. Now you have the Ace of Cups right here in your crowning position. This is what you know. This is what you're thinking about. Some of you, this could be a new love, okay? You're thinking about, a, you know, maybe you're going through a divorce. Maybe you just got out of a, a relationship. Or maybe you've been out of a relationship for a, a long time and you're ready. You know, just know that you could be meeting someone here soon. They're going to ask you out. You're going to, I mean, you're going to hit it off right from the start okay because this is a new beginning of love you know this represents a divine um, love as well so someone coming into your life that is good for you that you connect with uh, it's they're part of your your soul family okay this is abundance in so many in any area of your life where you feel like your cup has been running empty it's fixing to be filled up and overflowing okay now you have the Three of Swords as your outcome energy. Definitely getting three days, but three weeks is where I'm going to, you know, say the time frame is uh, at the most. But I do feel like it's going to be more around three weeks. It could be three days. It could be six days, uh, nine, twelve, okay? But I, I'm just, I'm, I'm getting from my guides right here three weeks, okay? Now, for some of you, like I said, if you're going through a divorce and stuff, it's been rough. You've been through some challenging times. Um, it's been very difficult, but it's over. It's fixing to wrap itself up. You can move on with your life, okay? I clarified it with the King of Swords right here, Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius, whether you're male or female. The King of Swords is that very analytical energy. It's logical. Uh, this is someone who really thinks before they act, okay? They're very smart and intelligent. A lot of times this can represent an attorney, uh, 
any type of legal situation i also feel like archangel michael is in your life very heavy very strong you are guided you are protected okay uh, making sure that any legal situation divorce whatever it may be your spiritual journey that you are you know the divine is playing a huge role in it let's let's just say that and use your you know use your throat chakra communicate what you want what you desire don't sit back and know that maybe you should say something or maybe ask for something or say hey i want this position i'm the one for this but you're you don't do it do it a closed mouth does not get fed and that's how you step into that leadership role okay the king of swords is definitely a leader he's a thinker this is a business person this is somebody that you know they they run the show you know and i do feel for some of you you know you're starting to look out for number one you're cutting off people places things that are no longer serving you anymore as well especially if it had to do with a relationship where you joined or combined friends or you made friends and it's kind of like you've decided to just walk away and start fresh start new okay um that's how i feel like how bad of a toxic uh, situation that you were in with your marriage or your relationship okay it's pretty bad we have awakening and silence beautiful spirits saying pull one more interesting focus <laughs> you guys got three so um you get an extra here all right so you have awakening I am joyously awake and aware and ready for anything. What was I saying at the beginning? Just, you know, further confirmation here. You guys are being spiritually enlightened. You are changing direction. You are ready for something new. And you're allowing the divine to guide you. And you're going with it. Now you have silence. I am serene no matter what is occurring around me. I think there's a need here for a couple of you to not get involved in a messy situation no matter who it involves if it doesn't involve you take a step back and observe be the observer okay um, and listen you will learn more that way and you will be able to be I feel like I want to say supportive because you're gonna see you know i i just feel like this is a situation that involves set a couple of people i think it's a family situation it could be a friend two friends but they're they're having a disagreement here they're both trying to tell their side of the story and things are not i just feel like you're gonna understand what happened you're gonna understand where it went wrong kind of and uh you're going to be able to get a hold on to it so you're going to be able to deal with it or or maybe uh, offer an opinion or some advice to them that is not going to come from a i feel like you judging someone it's more of an understanding is what i'm getting here very interesting aries uh let me know what that means to you because that's uh i can feel that one focus all of my thoughts are directed toward my highest good beautiful that's what your guides want you to think about and to be doing the next seven days you know focus on what it is that you want and desire set your intentions and start creating and that requires you to take that first step aries all right aries i love each and every one of you with all of my heart you guys please leave me a comment let me know how these energies are playing out in your situation i send you all my love wishes and blessings and i will see you guys back here tomorrow bye bye aries